All right. Next level. The headband stays on. Can't take it off. Alex, my sweat. No matter how much you ask, I'm not putting a chainsaw on your arm. So what do you want? But I want to be Ash from the Evil Dead. Never lets me be Ash from the Evil Dead. I had one of those and I forgot about it. I'm a dummy. I'm ever wondering why I'm saving up all this treasure. Because if I get both claws on both hands and feet, this game becomes hella fucking broken and hella fucking fun. I'm saving. The only problem is trying to get to get both of them is a pain in the ass. We are now on chapter 9. I can read Roman numerals. I can go up to 13 in Roman numerals. I'm not dumb. Oh, it's so nice here. I hate it. Get me out. Oh, great. I'm on a clock. The Graveyard of Remembrance. If you told me that was a place in Kingdom Hearts, I would believe you. The Graveyard of Remembrance is a place on the Jesus. castle that never was. This is... My dear, Get out of my head, weird creepy voice in my head. Fear not, for I'm about to run! <laughs> Alrighty. In this clock face, I've seen it somewhere before. I can jump. Great! Platforming in my hack and slash! Just what I love! Again! Graveyard of Remembrance. Sounds like something in either Kingdom Hearts or fucking Final Fantasy. Oi, Boyd. Yoink! Grab that bird. Come on. Come on down, bird. Come on down. Come on down. for somewhere, but before picking up the key. Oh. If I knew the locked door it belongs in, I'm just gonna check around here. Fine game. I will go over here then. Now will you let me go over there? No! What the fuck? I forgot about this part. How could I forget about this? Matt played this earlier this year! Now, I wish to get the shiny shit. Thank you.
Time to grab the shiny shit. Do da do da. It's gonna be my helpful kit. Oh, do do da day. Hold on. Ah, oh, I thought I could go in there. Remember, folks, be soft, but be angry. God, it's like being in a... Ah, oh, there's that golden bullet I so want. I'm breaking the laws of physics for this game. Whoop. And whooper. And whooper again. Ow. I thought there was something over there, okay? I, again, I really enjoy how, um, when it comes to, since we're walking around and we're not doing anything but platforming, I really love how, like, they decided for the angels and everything to use, like, Baroque, which, again, for those who don't know, I am a big fan of Baroque. If it's not Baroque, don't fix it. <laughs> yes, I still think that joke is fucking funny. Um, Baroque and Rococo styles are very extravagant. They're very heavy on the light on the usages of white and gold and when it comes to angels that actually i think is very appropriate because angels are always seen as good and pure well, not in this game um and you know they're pure and shit and i also really love how basically when you fight the angels and i think i mentioned this yesterday and i'm gonna mention again when you fight the angels they get more disgusting and their ugliness shows and just something about this design is really great and i really wish it's a great indicator as well as to tell you how much more damage you have to do to these guys. Yeah, destroy your friends! Please, do that! It's just something I really enjoy about this game. In the hole. Ah! This part always makes me dizzy. Again, there's something about it that just, like, really works for me. And I love it when people do use robot, uh, uh, Baroque and Rococo theming for their, um, for angels. Because I just, I always thought that was always a good theming. Well, this looks like a place we're gonna have a flat boss fight. There we go. A boss fight. Really? There we go. My least favorite angel. Also, run. Da 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 da. Hey, guy, remember you have the the new fast version of yourself now? Why don't you use that? The shadow remains calm. My least favorite angel. Da 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 I 
I don't like that angel. You'll see why, like, later. Its gimmick is a pain in the ass, and I hate it. Hey, no damage! Booyah, baby! Missing a gear. And now turn! Full dancing! Can I turn it that way, please? Now we go this way. I'm gonna need these. And here's the creature I hate. You hit it in there, you asshole. Thank you. 
Tick me off! I'm fine. I'm not angry. I'm actually doing pretty. I'm not angry. I'm not upset. I'm not annoyed. Okay, I'm a little annoyed. But I'm not ragey. Wrong one. Yep. Teleport over here. Dead. 
on! Jesus. Let go of me! Anything again. I hate this fucking...
Get over here. Get over here, kitty. how it works we just accept it works yeah bronze metal hi ginger how you doing welcome to heck oh heaven heck I don't know where we are anymore. We're just dealing with Enochian right now. witch heart. Makes a full witch heart. Health has improved! Yay! Oh, what now? Oh, not the boats! Not the boat angels! You're feeling great. Kinship! Yay! Kinship! I hate the boats! They're stupid! And that's why they're stupid! They- they're stupid. I hate them. Skip, 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 skip. Come on, come on. You can't dodge those! What the? Ginger, and I hope you do find a job you enjoy. Die, you stupid boats! Oh, let go of me. Oh, uh, what is that weapon? Bazooka? No! I thought you had to get the bazooka via killing. What's his face? Rodon! Gimme. Thank you. 
time. Powerful. I'm legit trying to remember. I make it. Up the wall. Also, Ginger, if you feel like hanging out, you can. Again, I know you're most likely busy right now. I will not force anything upon you. Are they? I have arrived. Hello, welcome to my death. How you doing, Ginger? <laughs> welcome to <laughs> my death, my funeral. <laughs> Gosh, this is so loud. Sorry, the game volumes are. No, weird. no, no. It's it's me. It's me. Oh, I'm. You're the I, problem. I had it. <laughs> yeah, the Twitch was not very loud, and so I didn't realize how loud my volume was. <laughs> I did some volume adjustments as much as I could, and I have no clue what I'm doing wrong. Bayonetta is weird, because again, this game was originally meant for, like, Xbox and PlayStation, not for PC and headphones. Also, welcome to- I don't know where the fuck we are, but it's pretty. <laughs> you missed my talk about Baroque art earlier. It was a very interesting conversation. And also, I think that I think the balance on the audio sounds pretty good. Okay. It's not too loud. Which is always a concern as a streamer. Yeah. And you stop running into shit, Bayonetta! I beg you! Never. And now time to fight the- Fuck! I fell down the hole! Oh no. Bayonetta go down the hole. Okay. Also, <laughs> why do we have a battering ram but we don't have cannons? Uh, because the battering ram was important. Uh-huh. And cannons <laughs> aren't? He- he- Battering ram is immediate. Cannons must be prepared. Battering ram is forever. Like <laughs> diamonds. Ah, uh, the lesser known song. Pain. Battering rams are forever. But, but with pain. Oh! Pop shots! You stupid angels! By the way, meet the sluts. Start joy. Is that why they sound, um, very provocative when yeah. they get hit? They sound like they like it a little too much. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I think you've got ouchies. Die! Do you have Kiwis? No. Oh no. I'm out of the healing. I'm out of healing herbs. I may or may not have eaten them all in the last boss fight. Yeah, I've eaten them all in my last boss fight. Oh no. They were delicious. 
You would think they'd provide... Well, I guess not all games do that. Yeah, also this is like normal like, mode, which isn't like hand-holding mode, but still. Yeah. Well, I just know like a lot of games, like right before a big fight, they're like, Hey, you're gonna... You, you're gonna you die. should talk up. Yeah. You should, you should uh, prepare. Kind of like when the DM's like, Hey, uh, y'all are about to go on this big mission. Do you want to get anything, anything at all? Anything, I beseech you. Get supplies. Please get some hemp and rope. Please get some hemp and rope. Ow. Also, you missed the zooming on the motorcycle. Where you got Ooh. to see my... Very wonderful driving technique, unlike what Core says. Are, are you being sarcastic, or do you actually have a good driving technique? Oh! Kinky! Oh. Oh. They're all oh consenting! <laughs> and this game was on Nintendo? Yeah. Nintendo owns the rights to this game! Nintendo, I feel like, mostly stopped doing M-rated games for a while, and now, maybe... Oh yeah, there's I don't know. so many M-rated games you can get on the... It's not, they're not made by Nintendo like Bayonetta is. But Bayonetta oh, went, yeah. like, down from M to T. Ah, boo! Like... I know there were M and R M rated Nintendo games. It's just like one of those things. Like I feel like they kind of. One of your favorite ones is one of the. Games. For... I know, I know. It was the. No, it wasn't the first one. The first M rated game Congress to come out. Uh. I think there was one before that, but I was gonna say for the GameCube, the first M rated game I believe was the remake of. Um, Resident Evil. Oh, Which I forgot you're resident. still alive, bitch! Die! But I could be wrong on that. I had that game, but I didn't play very far into it. Resident Evil? Uh, yeah, the re the GameCube remake specifically. Um, because I'm a scared little bitch. So, when I do the Resident Evil games again, don't invite you for the Halloween special, gotcha. I mean, I could probably watch- I think watching it would be different than playing it, because I think it was particularly the fact that it kept doing weird things with the- with the- with the cameras. Ah, uh, Which yes. then was part of the thing, like, the first- the first zombie you encounter, it, like, Almost creates a jump scare situation unintent well maybe intentionally, I don't know, because you get back into a corner and then the zombie kinda like oh. creeps into frame. Um and I was just like Fucking little scared bitch, nope. Mm -mm. Oh thank god there's a gate somehow. Oh, no. Sorry, I'm listening. <laughs> no worries. Like I can wa I've watched core there are some horror games I've played, but they're like light horror Jeez. games and I've watched core play Dead Face. But I don't think I could play Dead Space. Yeah, speaking, of so, Resident like, Evil, speaking of Resident Evil, they just did a they just did a Resident Evil 4 reference. Hmm. What are you buying? Oh, I did have healing! I forgot I have the stupid mega herb! I forgot about the mega herb. Shut up! There is a game I would love to. I don't think you'd be able to play all of it because it's borderline unplayable. I tried to play it to give it a chance um, because I like to form sometimes form my own opinions on games. Um, and I I love Eternal Darkness, uh, but you should try like a few a little like thirty minutes of uh, Two Human. Just because I'd love to see you rage at the controls. Because they are... Ah! If you have the same reaction to, as me, you'd be like, what the- Why does this do that? Why does this- Why? Why does this do that? Okay, come on, fall down. I... 
No, yeah, I, I love Eternal Darkness. Um, and so Two Human is there is another game that Silicon Knights did, and it is great in theory. Like, the story sounds great. The first, like, little bit of it where you get a cutscene, and it's like, oh, this looks badass as fuck. But everybody hates it. And I was like, I'd like to form my own opinion, because I love Eternal Darkness. And... The controls are... I, I can't even remember if they're dog shit for the time. I feel like they were. Like, it does some crazy things. <laughs> like, where you're just like, why does that do the way it does? But, playing, I don't know if there's a way for you to play Eternal Darkness, that would be cool. There's um, probably not a way for you to Nero do it has there. a way. Nero is a huge GameCube streamer. Oh yeah. I love Eternal Darkness. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, he will be playing Eternal Darkness as well. Okay, I feel like a... I feel, I feel, nice! I feel like a boss battle's coming. I don't know why, but my boss battle senses are tingling! Let me... Come on! Uh, well, I don't know if you've ever played... Fuck that Have you thing. played it before, Nero? Because that's one of my favorites. I've played it... Four times? Maybe five? Oh, fuck this thing! <laughs> fuck this thing! This does not look fun. It's my least favorite boss, and it's everyone else's least favorite boss. Oh, it's like Kane Kinetic Sand, or Kinetic Cube. It changes different forms! Oh, I hate this. I hate that. But it's better than the alien with- or not the alien. The angel with the mouth. With the fucking- I don't fucking... know! I'd rather deal oh, with oh. that than this! <laughs> ah, good! It's now in dragon form! I love dragon form! Ooh, I, I also have a physical cop. Yeah, I've played- I've played mine a lot. I'm in a- technically in a current playthrough. Um, and I think I'm up- through, which is we I was in a current playthrough and I hadn't played it in years and I was like, wow, these chapters move fast. What, this game? No, in the Turtle Darkness, the chapters move like faster than you expect them to if you're replaying or if you haven't played it in a while. I would love a... Because you have to play the game like, what, four times in order to get the true ending? You play it... Uh... Three times? Yeah, then you get the... I want to say three times and then you get the the true ending, and then in the fourth playthrough you can play and basically, like, you're unkillable. Um... Which is particularly fun with, uh, this one level that has these creatures that are basically, like, the thing from the, the thing, where they take over bodies. Because technically it's supposed to kill you, but it can do interesting things. You will uh, die under my feet! Sorry, I am so hyper focused on this right now because I hate <laughs> this boss. I hate this boss. Y'all don't understand. I was dreading going up against this boss because I hate it that much. Because I have war flashbacks of going against this thing. I'm going through Nam right now. I'm in the weeds! I killed it. Oh my god! Oh! When, it's in it, when it's in its circular form, I don't know why, but it reminds me of Unicron. I'm glad you see Unicron, because I see bitch. <laughs> Play volleyball Wait, with that it, thing! I was like, is she doing volleyball? Yeah, she is. Wait for it! My favorite part! It does remind me that, like... <sighs> in the new Transformers, the one that- the most recent one, Unicron was voiced by Coleman Domingo, and that's wild to me. Let's see if I can catch this. 
Yeah, no, I'd love a, a remake of Eternal Darkness. There's some company that specializes in um, remaking older games, and they've been trying to get Nintendo to, to like, let them remake Eternal Darkness, and Nintendo just, I guess, hates money, I don't know. Okay. Or they don't see the... The appeal. Hey. Yeah, which is possible. Did you see my claws? Yeah. See my claws. I mean, let me do a little bit. Are they claws? Yes. I just see, like, zappy zaps. They're claws. Wait for it. Watch this. Oh, I see. I see they're moving in, like... Lane claws! claws. <laughs> if I get the... The girl on fire! Thank you. <laughs> so, fun fact about these. Uh, you can buy a second set. I am currently saving up to try to get the second set, which you can put on your feet. And the game becomes stupid <laughs> fucking levels of broken. <laughs> <laughs> because if you still apparently if you do both lightning claws on both your hands and your feet and you fight the game gets so confused it all I've heard stories of it breaking down <laughs> and you want that to happen I just want to see it <laughs> end of chapter nine yay <laughs> I know I didn't do well hey. The thing about that reminds me of I made the mess. I found a glitch, so I'm replaying a Mass Effect right now. Oh, the first one. Ah. I'm gonna replay the whole trilogy, but I'm replaying it right now. And I found a glitch in um, Pharos Ooh. in the heart of Pharos, uh, which other people have found this glitch too. And it's basically there's like a part of the world that you can glitch through, oh. and you just fall indefinitely oh, okay. and i made the mistake because i hadn't saved in a while so i was like oh god if i have to quit this right now i have to redo all this like stuff and so like which was at least like maybe 45 minutes of content maybe like an hour or an hour and a half and right. so i was like oh i don't want to do that and so i was like well what if i save in the middle of it maybe it will you pop me back up because sometimes the if there's a glitch and you save and you save in the middle of a glitch it'll pop you where you're supposed to be no i i opened it back up and i'm falling indefinitely and i can't do anything did you i did can't you, did you make a backup save just in case well there was the last save i had but like i couldn't get to anything um, and so, I can't remember how I, because of how it's set up, it doesn't, the first one doesn't give you the option to, like, load a save. Oh, yeah. So, it starts you where you were, and for, like, the, I think the menu wasn't doing something? I don't remember. I don't remember how I got it, but somehow I was able to, like, finally load the previous save, and I just ended up having to do a really start, but, like, don't be, don't do what I did. Don't be a ginger. <laughs> bad don't be a ginger it, it fall through the hole in pharaohs just just take the l no matter how long ago you saved okay i'm gonna go to the bathroom actually ginger will keep you guys entertained